Hey, collective, it's your girl spiritual judge. I can feel it. Those of you who are intuitive, can you feel when you are when somebody hate? They just hate. You. They watch you and they hate. Like I can feel that shit. It's crazy. Okay. Well, look. Since I said that, poverty and thief. Some of y'all could have three people. Uh, three to four people. I don't know, Spirit. What's the message for my collector? Please and thank you. A gift. Could be because of your gift. But what they don't see is that you are held in high honor. Also, someone's going to pass away here with the coffin. Let's look at it. Mm hmm. Yep, death again. I can't make it up. They won't see this coming. Family. It could be someone who's either young or just childish. That's what I'm getting with this fool energy right here. Some type of plan that this person has. Hold on, what's that that flipped over? Yeah, this is definitely in y'all family, child. Four of wands, seven of swords. Told you they were planning and plotting against the Empress. Because of her gift and her money. So, like I said, no weapon form against y'all should prosper. Just period. And there's divine protection around you that these people cannot see. There will be a physical death. It's going to come out of nowhere. But y'all need to know why it's happening. There's a lot like with this high honor. Whoever you are, Empress, you're in high honor. On the spiritual realm. We don't care how it looks on the physical. You could look like an old Joe Schmo from on the corner. We're not talking about the physical stuff. See, that's where people get it wrong. They judge you. Well, if you broke, then you may not mean nothing. Mm -mm, God created us all. And it's about the personal relationship that we have with the divine that counts. Not about how much your shoes cost. You hear me? So, like I said, this empress here who may not have $5 in their pocket. Or they could. That ain't about that. It's about the personal relationship that they have with the, divine. with the divine. They are held in high honor here. And so there are some people that are coming up against this energy, man or woman, with the seven of swords. They, they're going to meet their, their demise. They could be dreaming of this. You know how people have premonitions of their own death, but the reason that they're dreaming of this is because of what they're planning to do to you. Um, there's always warning before destruction. So these people have been warned multiple times to stop. But they don't, they just, uh, I don't know if it's the hate, the envy, the greed, whatever it is, is overtaking someone's intuition. They're not listening, okay? So you have in their, in their feelings and trash. I just saw that caution card because I'm telling you, these people have been warned. But greed. I knew it. I said it's the greed or something that's taking over. It's taking over these people. It's more than one person, okay? Yep, looks can be deceiving. Is it salt or is it sugar? Because these people tell you that they're happy for you, they love you, this, that, and the third, you be the same motherfuckers that is planning and plotting against you. Even though you may not be able to see it, the most high God can. Okay, so, I don't know who this is that's about to pass away. So people doing drugs, worst nightmare, situations about to explode, bad choices. They fucked up the moment they decided to come up against you. Some of these people could die of an overdose. They could die from, I'm hearing fake pills, fake something, fentanyl, heroin, whatever they used to getting, it's going to get a, it's be a bad batch of it, okay? Some shit like that. Yeah, they're getting kicked straight to the curb. Because they're planning to do something to this empress. Yep, look at that. But see, what they're not ready for is that empress's protection. Hold on, y'all. They're not ready for that spiritual protection that someone's about to put up. It's a lot of drama around the empress. And like I said, this could be a man. This empress could be a man. Take it where it resonates. There's definitely going to be an overdose or the death of some type of drugs like this person will take one pill but it's not going to be what it says it is and they die 
they would take out wow this person was taking up space okay so it could be an aquarius but we got putting on the show in the reverse so i don't know if they're gonna smoke something take snort something whatever the fuck it is page of swords in the reverse this person is like obsessively watching this empress it's going to be something that they do it's gonna take them right up out of here yeah anger they could be real angry at the empress. This could this empress could be a mother, but they got a lot of toxic people. So let's go more into detail. Yep, ten of cups is family, and it landed on top of that doing that drugs, and that's how somebody's gonna pass away. All right, what else here? God is not playing. That's the damn truth. Somebody gonna either take a pill, snort something that they think is powder, is hair, is going to kill them. But do you know why this is happening? Because of what they're doing to this person. People think shit is unrelated. No. <laughs> you got to connect the dots, boo-boo. Like we used to do in first grade. Play to connect the dots. Someone is sitting here lying, stealing, cheating, being sneaky in this empress's energy and it could be someone who lived with this empress okay or someone in this empress's family so even though this empress is loving and caring the most high god sees the truth and there's a lot of high honor high protection look at this card you have to go through some fucking cannons before you get to the empress so and i heard whoever this is they're taking up space so i don't know what that means I do know whatever drugs these kids, ooh, kids. Now, whether they are actual teenagers or just childish people, whatever drugs they're doing, they're going to get a, a bad batch of something, y'all. I don't even, so we got weed, we got powder, we got pills, and we got alcohol. Something's going to have something in it, and it's going to, this is divinely orchestrated, though. It's going to take somebody up out of here. But see, Spirit says this person's wasting air like wasting space someone's worst nightmare and see with this bad choice the moment they decide and i've been picking this up for over a month the moment that they decided to come up against this empress of course that was a bad choice and now they biting their nails these people could be having visions of their own death with the tower in the reverse okay it's because of who they decided to come up against people y'all know we are in spiritual warfare and yes, it it would be family. The devil got to work through people that's closest to you. That's why the four ones right there. So some just know that you're gonna get a message about someone in your family. How this is this is instant. That two of swords, they're not gonna see this coming. Somebody's gonna smoke something, drink something, take something, and they're not gonna wake up. Okay, what else, spirit? Period. I'm telling you, they're not gonna wake up. Four of Swords. This is the health card. Someone's about to die. Period. And you see that stained glass window? Y'all will be per putting this person in a casket. I don't know who this is. It's a karmic. Man or woman, it's a karmic energy. Okay, what else, Spirit? Eight of Wands. Like I said, you're going to hear about this. You're going to hear how this person passed away. Could be a Gemini. They going on wherever they came from. Okay. So with the Eight of Cups here. Someone that you had to emotionally walk away from. Yep. You were guided to do it. Hmm. But it's someone in your family now. Or either someone you have a family with. It's someone in your family who does drugs. This person is greedy. They're fake. As fuck. That is also what I'm getting with this. Is it salt or is it sugar? Looks can be deceiving because someone's going to do something off this card. Whether it's weed, pills, powder, alcohol, and it's not going to be what they think it is. Okay? Looks can be deceiving. Is it salt or is it sugar? Some type of drug is not going to be what the fuck they think it is and it's going to be their last nighty nighty. And it was because they were a magician in the reverse. 
You have no reason to be seven of swords and an empress. Someone who's standing in their true energy. There's no reason for it. None. Okay? I don't. It's just period. So, what else, spirit? Spirit gonna handle what they got to. Yeah. Hmm. Five of swords. Jealousy. Envy. Hatred. This is also criminal activity. But this criminal activity landed on top of that damn high honor. They're trying to go up against this empress. They will lose their life. They will lose their life. Whoever this is that is planning and plotting against this empress will lose their life. Period. I see a mother and a child here. Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. Whatever this person thought they was going to get, they will not. They're going to get a casket. I showed y'all this four swords. I said somebody was about to die when this card came out. And even on this card, casket. See, the problem is people don't believe in tarot. They don't believe in tarot. They don't believe in the dreams that they be having because whoever this is is already um, having dreams of them dying. Because that's what, what the tower is in the reverse next to this bad choice. Is someone's already having premonitions of them dying. And that's why they is nervous the way they are. Because they know what they was doing right here. Okay. So, like I said, one comes before destruction. But if they have already put something in play against this empress, it's, it's a wrap. Okay. I'm also getting jail for somebody. Let's keep on, spirit. What else? Yeah. Three of swords. This person will cause a lot of pain in the world. That's why spirit said that they... Are taking up space. They brought more pain than they did good. And it could be someone's son. They brought more pain. Okay? So with the Two of Pentacles, the Two of Pentacles is having a lot of shit going on. Yeah, someone's angry. Just anger. Or it could be a Leo. Not If it's not a son, it could be a Leo. But somebody's just angry. Why are you so angry? Anger don't do shit. I'm trying to tell you. I spent some time in my life being angry. I, I was never angry at God, but I spent some time, some time in my life being mad at some folk, and it didn't get me nowhere. Okay? So, with the Three of Cups, it's like, whoever this Queen of Pentacles is, man or woman, they're going to be at some type of... There, there's the police with the justice. I'm telling you, somebody going to jail, somebody young with that Nine of Cups, they're going to jail. Could be a Taurus with the Hierophant for a long time. Seven of Pentacles. For a long time here. Somebody's going to jail for a long time. Yeah. So with the Page of Swords, that is a watching and gathering information. Uh, they could be trying to figure out where someone is. But you see that Five of Wands. Whoever is, yeah, they're watching someone who get a lot of attention. But there's somebody watching this person. The justice system, whether this is spiritual or uh, physical justice, whoever this person is watching, the justice is watching them. You see how this works? There's always an eye in the sky, whether it's spirit or the uh, cameras. Because someone is coming towards someone with this Knight of Cups, it's not real. It's fake and phony. And so because of it, somebody about to go to jail. That's the, the police car, the hierophant with the justice, strength right here with the three of cups. Look at this. Somebody's stressing over work. Three of pentacles, queen of cups, five of pentacles with the world, and the four of cups. Whatever these people, that's why I'm telling y'all, whatever this is that these folks have tried to do to y'all, it's not going to go according to plan. And I have been saying it for a month. I guess these people who be watching my readings don't be thinking I'm talking to them. Oh, she talking to everybody but us because our plan going to be successful. Somebody about to successfully find their ass having their family pick out a fucking coffin because they're not listening. And others are going to successfully find their ass behind bars. Thank you, Spirit. You know what the Five of Cups is? It's regret because there's always warnings before destruction. 1444 on the phone. Someone's too protected. In this spiritual realm, because this is spiritual warfare. 
I've been saying this shit for a month. That is exactly what this is. Why else would you come up against an empress unless this was spiritual warfare? Like, I don't get what the fuck is going on. You have a demon here and an empress. They're going to regret the moment that they decided to come up against you. And that's just period. All of them. All of them. Okay, so you got this um, Knight of Pentacles. That's an earth sign. Capricorn, Cross of Virgo. Who is planning to do some fucked up shit. Mm. They're planning to do something horrible. But it's not going to be a wish fulfillment. Thank you, Spirit. Now the cup's in the reverse with the star in the reverse. It's not going to... I told you, jail. Why don't people listen to me? This shit that this person has been manifesting, it's all coming back down on them because they have no reason to be doing what they're doing. This is not going to be a wish fulfillment for nobody. But this empress, because this empress ain't bothering nobody. Whether this empress is a, is a man or a woman. There's something about a child here. I keep seeing this page of pentacles. An earth sign child or a Gemini. Okay? That someone either needs to protect or protect themselves from. <laughs> Excuse me. Three of Wands. Yeah, somebody. I'm telling y'all. You got... Someone here that's going to pass away could be a Scorpio. This person about to die from something. Um, also, someone's health is not good. Someone, and they're not going to see this coming. They're just going to die. Mm, mm, mm. Okay. Yeah, it's three people that is secretly doing some shit. All of them is going to end bad for all three of them. Ooh, cha 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 cha. What was that? Yeah, those are the three people that's watching and planning and plotting. That's not gonna. I'm tired of warning them. I really am. You hear me? They gonna go to fucking jail because they're overdoing their control with the emperor coming out here in the reverse. This is the police car. This is the fucking courthouse. There's a cancer or a tourist that's overdoing their fucking control. And baby. Like I said, I've been warning these people. I have been warning them. They will be, someone's going to be mourning someone's death anyway. Because somebody's about to pass away. Just, they're not going to see this coming. Yeah, sudden. Towel. Sudden. I'm telling you, it's like the moment that they decided to go up against this empress. That's when all of these, the, the divine had to start moving shit divinely orchestrating thank you spirit divinely orchestrating things somebody's gonna die because of their health is fucked up somebody's gonna die because they're doing some type of drug and it's not even got it's, that it's an overdose they can pop one pill and that one pill gonna take them out here because something is not right with these drugs but like i said it's divinely orchestrated because whoever these people are that are leaving this earth they have been um Taking up space. They don't put out any good. It's like always planning and plotting and stealing and being sneaky. They don't bring any good to anyone. Okay? And these times that we in, you got to be about serving. These people don't know how to serve anyone's but anybody but themselves. That's why the car came out spoiled. These people are very selfish, very greedy, very entitled, very narcissistic. Just wasting space, you know. So... And these people, like I said, they already done seen their damn deaths. I don't know why they still doing what they're doing. Like, it made no sense. It makes no sense. What else, Spirit? Ten of Wands in the reverse. Six, somebody with the Six of Pentacles, somebody takes care. Like, you could take care of these people. You could send them money with the Six of Pentacles. But with the Ten of Wands in the reverse, it's like somebody just needs to drop this whole burden. It's a burden. Because you cannot go up against the divine. You just can't. I mean, you can, but where will it lead you? To a wish not fucking fulfilled. A wish not fulfilled here. And stressing your fucking eyeballs out. 
and then being investigated. King of Swords. Because I promise you, now my face is hot. I promise you somebody going to jail here. Mm-hmm. Page of Cups on top of this Emperor. I don't feel like there's no real damn... Now, this emperor might be having to get away from someone because this emperor landed on top of the eight of pentacles with the, I mean, the eight of cups with the six of swords. The emperor and the empress could be going through this. I said this a month ago. I, I said these, these two people have people around them, people in their family, people that they know that they cannot trust because, like I said, this is spiritual warfare. Spiritual warfare, y'all. Please listen to me. Okay? What does that mean? We are in the times where your own fucking child will come and shoot you in the face. Those are the times that we in. It's all about choices. These motherfuckers could choose to do something else, but they're not. It's like just when one plan doesn't go the right way, they make another one. With the seven of swords. They're doing it for money. This is crazy. I just said they're doing it for money. Ten of Pentacles. They're going after someone who gets a lot of success because they are karmic. These people have attachments to them. Devilish attachments. That's why Spirit says they're taking up space. And they're with the devil with the King of Pentacles. They're superficial. All they care about is money, and that's the reason that they don't have any. Whoever this is, they don't know how to manifest. When you put out into the universe, the moment that you say, well, I got to steal something from someone else, that tells the universe that you feel like you don't have enough, or you feel like you can't create your own. And so you're going to only get back what you put out. Like, this is crazy. <sighs> King of Swords. King of Pentacles, Six of Cups, Five of Pentacles. Fucking with this earth angel, you will be left out every time. Because these people are spiritually dead. They don't even know they have an attachment on them. They so used to walking around, um, stealing and lying and cheating and being sneaky, that they realize, they think that shit is normal. Oh yeah, I just finessed this one up out of that today. Yeah man, I had to do this and I had to, that ain't normal. 22-22 on the phone. And all that negative shit that you don't know why spirit says somebody is just wasting space. Wasting space. They don't know how to serve because they only think about themselves. Okay. High priestess could be a Pisces. Uh, Eight of Pentacles with the Four of Cups. Whatever this is that they're working on in secret, it will not. This is the last time I'm going to say this shit. Because I done did about four or five readings over the last three months of you got a bunch of fucking foolish motherfuckers and maybe one or two adults that's playing in the dumbest shit I've ever fucking heard, okay? This shit that they're working on in secret will not go anywhere. Period. People will find themselves dead, in jail, caught up before they're successful at stealing something that the divine blessed someone else with in this period. You have to be careful who you fuck with just because you've gotten away with some shit in the past. Okay, maybe that person didn't have this high level of protection. Spiritual warfare. They're literally fucking with the earth angel. This demon. And this demon has to have a body. It has to have a body to do its devil work. Now, people that you loved and cared for hate you. And they want to see you gone. Or they want to see, I don't know what the hell they want to see. But I'm telling you, someone's going to be burying someone. Death, death, five of cups with the four of swords. Somebody's going to die just like that. I don't know if it's an STD that they're about to die from. But their health is not... On the up and up, it's gonna take a turn for the worse. It don't matter if they if this person was perfectly healthy. What they don't realize with the tower here, this is divine intervention. The moment that they they decided to come up against this person, that's when everything's taking a turn for the worse. Like people don't put the shit together. <sighs>
But I'm tired of warning these folks. They're not going to stop. It's like they get upset. Instead of them taking the heed, oh, well, uh, we weren't able to get this person that way. Instead of them taking heed to it, no, they do more planning and plotting. And it's just like, yeah, because they toxic. Like I said, the devil has to have a body to use. Mm, mm, mm. Angry. Ooh, yeah. Okay, so here. What is going on here? God box. Yeah, somebody too protected. Hey, too protected. What did that card say? Did it? Yeah, shield yourself. I'm telling you, goddess, that's the divine feminine. You're having to shield yourself because you got some crazy motherfuckers on the they could be trying to take you out, but that's not that's not what's gonna happen. Y'all just saw them cards. And people think, oh, why would they do that? Spiritual warfare, y'all. What else, here? Spiritual warfare. Damn. Law of attraction. What you put out is what you get back. And the way that card flew all the way over there. <sighs> mm, mm, mm. So collective, everything around you is changing because you, you're you sensitive. And it's like now that you become more aware of the energy, y'all, when this started, when I first started this video, I felt the hatred and then look what all came out. I felt somebody watching with hate. But thank you, God. Spirits ain't nothing to worry about. I'm telling you, somebody gonna find it. Listen, y'all got three motherfuckers. Okay, I don't give a fuck how old or how young they are. One of them is going to die from taking something that they think is that and it's not. The other one's going to die from some type of health issue. It's just going to come out of the nowhere. And the other one's going to jail for a long ass time. I don't know why people don't want to listen to me. They think I just do this shit for fun. No, this is real deal. And I'm telling you, what you put out is what you're going to get back. And the Most High God is telling my empresses, my goddesses, that there's nothing here to worry about. These karmics may have took you out in another lifetime, but they're not going to do that this lifetime. Okay? Some of you guys have some type of creative project. Remember, we kept seeing the Eight of Pentacles. And that's why this goddess is having to shield herself because of her work. People are envious of your work. But you see all these angels around you? Let me. It says state of progress, right? We acknowledge you for the progress that you made and remembering love and your daily activities. The other people ain't putting out no fucking love. That's why Spirit said they wasting space. You're supposed to serve. These people don't serve nothing but they self. Okay? So, somebody don't like your manifestation powers. They don't like the things that you're creating. They want to try to steal from you. But Spirit says they ain't nothing to worry about. Spirit says you are safe. And this situation is under divine perfect control. Thank you. That's why I say Spirit will sit something in their way every time they try to come against you. That's why they get mad. Every time they do something towards you and it don't work out, they get angry. But they're not sitting there making, taking the time to think, well, maybe we need to leave this person the fuck alone. No, they're going to plan and plot some more shit. Because they're greedy. Somebody is going to be mourning, motherfuckers. You, they're going to need that money to buy some cash. They're going to need that money to get them some lawyers and shit. Because when the Most High God tell me it ain't nothing to worry about, I don't worry. Thank you, Spirit. Thank you. I told y'all, it's twin flames that's going through this shit. Because y'all are earth angels. So, of course, these fucking karmics, what the cards say... Past life issue. I said they may have took y'all up out of here in another life, but they're not gonna do that shit this life because y'all have done the work. Let me read the card. This situation has a basis in one of your previous lifetimes. Ask your angels to help you remember, release, learn, and heal from the past experiences. The moment that the two of y'all did the work to step in that emperor and empress energy, y'all healed these karmic situations. So they can't take you up out of here no more like they did in previous lifetimes. People think this shit is fake and, and it's just for show. No, baby, this is real motherfucking deal. And a lot of y'all gonna be a, a guy to cut off from people that you 
been knowing your whole life. Stop looking at these motherfuckers on the physical. Oh, they're my sister. And what does that mean? How's your sister's soul? How's your sister on the soul level? And your body will always let you know. Your, you don't even be wanting to deal with them because you feel the energies of it. You feel when motherfuckers hate you. They be trying to hide it. They can't even, <laughs> look, they be so robotic and so fake with it when they try to tell you that they love you. Um, well, I just wanted to tell you that I love you, and um, that's it. Well, damn, could you get in there faker than that? Like, you ain't supposed to see through that shit. You see right clean through them and get what you tell them. I love you, too. And keep on pushing. They think, yeah, I got, uh, I got them on my side, and I'm doing it like, no, bro, you, you look like a fucking fool. Because everything that you're down here doing... The most high God is up there watching. And before you can step your motherfucking foot out there to fuck with that empress, God be done, put a damn, lay the fucking house on top of you. You won't be able to do shit. Divinely orchestrated. But damn, it's a coincidence that I got pulled over at the stop sign. Hmm. When I just came from the house talking to my homeboy, planning and plotting how we're going to do this, and then I get ready to go home, and I'm at the stop sign, and all of a sudden we get pulled over, and we got a damn chopper in the car, now we all going to jail. That's what you call divinely orchestrated. Hello? Oh, it's funny. I just went to, the, I've been going to the doctor all week, everything straight, and I just left from homegirl house, planning and plotting on the Empress. Doctor called me in out of nowhere after telling me that my test results was negative. Doctor called me in out of nowhere telling me I got two weeks to live. Divinely orchestrated. Fuck with it if you want to.